Oh my gosh, boys, we have such a special episode. I'm actually very excited. While I was away at work today, EA did the unthinkable, except it's actually pretty predictable because they usually do it. They dropped an e EFL Championship Player of the Year. And the guy is four years younger than me. I don't even think we would have gone to the same high school. Damn. Anyway, you can see him right there. 87 rated Ryan Sessegnon. I hope Spurs get him. He plays left back. He plays left wing. He plays left mid. He's a left winger card, but then it's weird because in the SBC, which you'll see here, he's actually a left back. I did this. It's only about 50K, so it's pretty cheap. And I mean, you get a spectacular card. Let's go ahead. I just found this on Footbin and uh, it was pretty cheap. So let's go ahead and submit that. Look at this card. His eyes are so large. So let's look at some of these stats. He was born in 2000. Damn. He's young as hell. He's got 92 pace. He's got 88 dribbling, 85 shot, 86 passing. He has good defense and physical because like I mentioned, he plays left back at times. Only three star, three star, which is a little bit bad. Uh, some people want to play him at left back, which I don't really understand because his defending and physical sets are pretty good, but they're not that great for a left back. And he has high medium work rates. Look at some of these stats though. 97 composure. 92 finishing, 92 shot power, 99 agility, 99 balance. The acceleration's a little bit low, but that's not a huge deal. This card might be one of the most responsive I've ever used, except for the fact that ball control and dribbling is kind of low. So I went ahead and put the sniper chem style, so that gives three chevrons to dribbling. I don't know exactly what that does, but I know it's going to make the ball control and dribbling a lot higher, which should as chemistry, I'm pretty sure chemistry functions exactly as it says on footbin on foothead. This card might be ridiculous for 50k we've thrown him into the best squad i've ever created definitely not even a doubt this is called get him on the plane united and look at the squadron we have everyone here in my opinion should be on that plane especially rob green if you're wondering why we have tammy abraham he can sing andy carroll he has great hair messi lingard he dances we like the handicapped people on this team as well. Raheem Sterling, we gotta have someone who's gonna miss everything, who's gonna be really English. We got Kyle Walker, he's fast. Michael Keane, he is expensive, and he wasn't that great this year. Uh, Liam Moore, he's gotta get on the plane because I did the SBC. Danny Rose, whenever he's injured and Ben Davis plays at left back, Spurs suck. And we got Tom Heaton, he also has nice hair. And of course our manager is going to be eating worms on the sidelines, so of course we're going to win. Oh my gosh, Benjamin Mendy, speaking of wheelchair people. I need everyone right now to just destroy the like button. I'm not even talking about like a metaphor like smash the like button, bro, dab, hashtag. I, I need you to actually like punch through the computer and destroy it. Because I don't like the like button anymore. Or, instead of that, you guys could give me a million likes and that'd also be cool. Alright, he's got Lo- whoa, when did- is that Lamar? When did he get a new face? And when did he go 83 rated? Oh, here we go with Sessegnon. Okay, 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 show those jets. Show that passing, Andy Carroll, he needs to be on several planes. He should always be on a plane. Sessegnon, still with it. He's- he's pretty quick. Uh, doesn't have skill moves though, dang it. Look at Ryan Sessegnon. Oh my gosh. Stop being so fast. Stop it. It's not fair. Think of the children. You are a child. What are we- who, I'm confused. Where is Rai Guy? Get it to Rai Guy. Where's Rai Guy? Rahim! Vintage Rahim! Okay, that's not Vintage Rahim. He actually scored. If it was Vintage Rahim, he would have toe-poked it into row Z. Run, Tammy. Yes, Tammy. This is what I like. This is what I like. That's the ish I do like. Jack Wheelchair. Plays a 1-2. Andy Carroll. Oh, you can't give Andy that much room. What do you think we're... What? Get a haircut, Samson. Sessegnon. He has some strength to him. He has some strength. And he still has it. And he's going to score. Um... He didn't. Tammy. Yes, Tammy. Where's Sessegnon? Why is Ryan... Ryan? I need you to just stay up. You're supposed to score. Right foot. Thank you. Do that more. Do it more. It was a good first touch. He hit it with the right foot. And uh, what more can I say? 97 composure. And he's 17. I don't even have 97 composure when I use the bathroom. Go Lingard. Messi Lingard. Plays it down. Tammy. Sing me a song, Tammy Abraham. Sing me a song that we'll, we'll cherish for the rest of our lives. Andy Carroll. Maybe you don't need a haircut. Oh, look at Sessegnon go. Oh, look at him go. Look at him move. 
Look at the dance moves. He doesn't really have skill moves though. He does have a left foot. Is it magic? It's pretty good. It's pretty tasty. 4-0. Is my sweet lover gonna leave? Oh, goodbye. All right. He's playing Aaron Wyatt Striker. And he has 90 rated Pogba. Oh crap, this guy might be really good. So looking at these traits, he does, or specialties actually, speedster and acrobat, he doesn't have speed dribbler, so he's not gonna be really, really fast with the ball at his feet like Chucky Lozano or Bailey. Oh no. Oh, Clivert. I didn't even realize that was Clivert at center mid. That's why he played him there. Great save, Tom Heaton. Get on the bus. Oh, what a pass by Tammy. Go. Sessignon against Florenzi. You've got the pace. Left foot. Hit it. Oh. Holy crap, that almost went in. Oh, crap. He's offside, right? He's off. No, he's not. Oh, my goodness. Oh, what a pass. No, Clivert. Oh, gosh. Boys, I'm getting ripped open here. I didn't sign up for this. I kind of did though. One, two with Andy Carroll. Oh, look at the speedster. Andy Carroll, what a speedster. Sessignon plays it in. Tammy, come on. One, twos, Sessignon wide. He's gonna cut it in. That's a pen. That, um, excuse me, ref, what are you doing? Good one, twos. Here's Tammy Abraham looking for that pass. It is Messi Lingard. Pied Piper time? I believe it is. It's the Pied Piper time. Da 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 da. All right, we made it to halftime. It's a tight game because this guy's good and he has a good team. Ryan Sessignon is not doing as much as I really was hoping. I might actually put him at striker. Um, well, the thing is, I don't really want him to. I want him to play on the left. My, maybe I'll do. Uh, I'll change his. Excuse me. Sessignon's not doing what I want, so maybe I'll do stay forward. Is there like a get in behind? Stay wide. Is there a get in behind? Yeah, there we go. Maybe we'll do that. It's like he he knows that he's a left back in reality. So he's trying to play as a left back when I want him to play really far forward. Go, Sessignon. Come on. Show off those wheels. There you go. Overlap time. Overlap time. Ryan Sessignon. He's got to score this. Low driven. Oh my gosh. What the heck is Donnarumma? A giant Italian. That's the answer. Come on, Tammy. Do what... What are you doing with your life? This is not an R&B album. All right, Tammy is not cutting it, so we're putting on the man who knows how to score last-minute goals, Danny Welbs. No, it's Clivert. Oh, Clivert, what a save, Tommy. <laughs> what a legend, man. Get him on that plane. Come on, we got to push it to the limit. Push it to the limit, boys. Go. Where's Ryan Sessegnon? I need you with your pace to lead this attack. Danny Welbs, what a touch. Danny Welbs! I hate Donnarumma, man. Welbs, Andy Carroll. Sessignon on the left foot. Sessignon on the left foot. Give me a break. Break me off a piece of that fancy feast. I mean, really good job. Danny Welbeck has actually been spectacular. Uh, Andy Carroll with the assist. It was that little hesitation. Florenzi thought I was going to cut it down. I went around him. Silly Italians. There you go, Sessignon. Get that angle. Go wide, Ryan. Go wide, Ryan. Wide, Ryan. Oh my gosh. It was almost a pen. Extra time. No. I almost would rather lose. Jack Wilshire has a debilitating injury called being Jack Wilshire, so we're gonna take him off and put on our favorite Steven Gerrard lookalike, Oxlade Chamberlain. Andy, wait for Ryan. Andy, wait for Ryan. There you go, Ryan. Ryan Sessignon. <gasps> what? Oh my gosh. I don't think I messed up that bad with the finish. That was just, he didn't hit it well. Yes, Welbs. Yes, Danny. Yes, Danny. To the Pied Piper. Okay. Donnarum saved that too. I, I don't know what I would have done. But you know what I will do now. Oh, shoot. No, he got me. Oh, I'm so dumb and bad. Oh, I'm so dumb and bad, man. Inside, Andy Carroll. Go. The ox. Still the ox. It's still an ox. There's an ox on the field. Everyone, watch out. There's an ox. Oh, Ryan Sessignon scored again. You should do something about that animal, though. Oh, we win. Good game. Good game, man. Messi Lingard played 9.4. Sessegnon had two. Lingard had two. They're both really good. Sessegnon came up clutch a couple times. He missed one huge opportunity, though. All right, match number three. He's got Eric Lamella, my least favorite Spurs player of all time, also known as the man who, for some reason, started over Hyungman's son, also known as Captain Stepover or Captain Ball Roll. Sessegnon, one, two. Another one, two. Wait for that run. Wait for Sessegnon to get over. He still has it. He's going to center it to someone, back post. 
I mean, what a finish. I mean, there really are no words. Oh, crap. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's Mo. Oh, no. What are we doing? What have I done? Why did I do that? I'm so confused. Yes, Jack. Go, Jack. Captain Jack Sparrow. Ryan Sessignon. Right foot, left foot, what foot? Oh, my gosh. He's not finishing him. Oh, look at Sessignon. That was actually really impressive because I shouldn't have given him the ball there. Running at full speed, he still managed to hold on to it, and he could. This is actually really good if he gets... Oh my gosh, that would have been such a nice play. Oh, Tammy, look at the moves. He can sing, he can dance, he can tap dance. Sessignon missed another one. Oh my gosh, it's unbelievable. I honestly feel like we could be up 4-1 right now, but I just keep missing really easy chances. Sessignon's missed at least two. Uh, someone else missed one. I think it was Lingard. So, yeah, I'm just not being clinical enough. I don't know if it's my finishing, if I'm a little bit rusty, or if it's Sessignon isn't too great of a shooter, which I'm kind of leaning towards that slightly because he's missing all the traits and specialties. But his shooting stats, his attributes seem like they should lend themselves to being pretty good at finishing. Lingard into Tammy. Left foot, Tammy! Oh, you got to score it. All right, Tammy's not cutting it. I don't know what has gotten into him. We'll put on Welbs. Oxlade Chamberlain on for the wheelchair. Andy Carroll plays it. It's Welbs. It's that man, Welbs. Why did I try to chip it? Oh my gosh. I keep doing that. Oh wait, we could, we could still do something here. It's Andy, left foot. Oh, Andy. Oh, they get penalty. <laughs> the game is so nonsense. I can't believe they've actually given that as a pen. You'll see, the offense was committed by the Korean. It's tragic. All right, we're giving this to Ryan Sessignon. 47 for penalty. How do you have 97 composure and 47 for pens? Well, he seemed cool there. One, two, another one. Oh, it falls through. Sessignon right foot. I can't believe he's put that wide. No, Ryan, he's missed every chance this game. I don't know if he scored. Oh, crap. No, and oh, he comes right upfield with Memphis Depay. Oh, Sessignon, man. He's killing me. Oh, that's a pen. That's a pen. Is it, He's given another one. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, what a blunder. I was going nowhere. Chucky, Chucky, Chucky. This one was a clear pen because he just kind of ran into me. 47 pen. The weight of the world on your back. Do it for England. Do it for the squad. Yes, he did it for the squad, boys. Ryan Sessignon. He shows up when the lights are brightest. Full time. There you go, boys. We're hanging in here. I'm one away from getting another handicapped player on my team in Benjamin Mendy. Oh, no, guys. He's got Musa Sissoko at striker. We're going to lose. We're, we're going to lose this match pretty easily. Oh, he's onside. Tammy, run. Run with all 12 of your pace. Still Tammy. Still Tammy. Still Tammy. Whoa. What? What? Why did Tammy Abraham decide to actually become the Tammy Abraham that got us Elite 3 like a month and a half ago? Andy Carroll has to win a header. He has to win a corner. Okay, there you go. Please do that, Andy. Get him on the plane because he does things like that. What don't you understand? Play it through. Andy Carroll. One more over. It's Sessignon. There you go, Ryan. Come on. That's what I need you to do. 3-0. Cutting. If you stay wide and then cut inside. No one is going to keep up with you. You just do fast. Do that. And don't be Paulo Dybala. Tippity Duda gets it over to Ryan Sessignon. Takes it down. Could have drawn a penalty. Oh, he scored from that angle. What in the world is he doing? For now, how come you can score from that angle, but you can't score from right in front of the net? Lingard. One more. It's Ryan Sessignon. Just do that. Just do that. Oh my gosh. 5-0 hat trick inside the first half. I think that's the first half trick he's actually scored in this episode. Which is a little bit sad. Oh no, El Matador. Oh, he kept on to it. 5-1. I wanted this guy to rage quit because I want to go eat my fried chicken nuggets. They're upstairs. Halftime. This is a very good half. We've scored every shot on target. Oh, it's Sessignon. Sessignon. Load. Oh, he's got to score that. That if, he's, if he could score that, this card would be almost unstoppable. Uh, Salat scored no. 5-2. This comeback better not... We're not Barcelona. 
Oh my gosh, boys. Holy crap. He's 5-3. Oh no, what's going on? We are Barcelona. Here's Sessegnon with a great turn. Left foot. There you go, Ryan. Come on. Hey, Ryan. It's Michael Jackson. Play it down. Sessegnon. He's onside. He could score again. He does. 7-3. Sessegnon has found the angle. And my sweet lover must leave us today. Goodbye, sweet lover. Look, we got Benjamin Mendy. What am I going to do with him? All right, so that's going to conclude this episode. Ryan Sessegnon, buy him or nah, complete him or nah, get him on the plane or nah. He scored 10 goals in four matches played. Uh, he wasn't, and he really, honestly, he, he had Raheem Sterling syndrome. If he was clinical, he easily could have scored like 15. The things that are, this card has a lot of positives. It also has some pretty big negatives though. I'll start with the positives because there's so many. He's fast, he's agile, he has great stamina, he's pretty strong on the ball, he's got good composure, he's got good passing, he makes the good runs, he follows directions. When you put him on set forward, uh, he doesn't stay back. And I mean, it's, it's a cheap card too. Now some of the negatives, his composure and finishing and shot power are really good. But for whatever reason, I don't feel that confident shooting with him unless it's in a really good angle on the left foot. He did score probably three or four goals on the right foot, so it's definitely not bad to shoot it on the right foot on the weak foot. But uh, he much prefers shooting it on the left with that angle. And it's like you have to play him on the left hand side. You can't play him as a striker, which some people might be tempted to do because of the pace and the dribbling and the composure. But you really have to play him on the left hand side for him to thrive. Now the reason why I think this card is an absolute must buy, at least for me, is because I like to play the 3-4-2-1, 3-4-1-2, whatever formation with three at the back, where you have a left mid and a right mid. Here's an example of that. Now with any of the three at the back formations, these players really play as wing backs in the way that I like to have it, where I have them on get back, uh, come back on defense. But the thing is, these players are always left wide open on the overlap because everyone pays attention to these three players in the middle. Sometimes one of the center mids comes up and sometimes the guy on the opposite side will play a little bit more inside. So whoever's on the opposite end is almost always free. And the problem with this player is I never could find someone who was fast enough, who had a good enough shot in terms of finishing and could also play defense. But this card is like the perfect answer for that. This is the exact kind of player that I would need and I mean if I play if I'm gonna play weekend league it's hard for me to really find the enjoyment find the kind of kickstarter the catalyst that makes me want to do it but playing this formation with Ryan Sessegnon he would probably be one of the top goal scorers in this formation and it'd be really fun to use so 50k he's probably gonna get team of the season as well for when the championship comes out so you might just be able to buy him if you don't want to have to do the untradeable version uh, I really don't care. I mean, I I like doing these kinds of cards because they're just fun to review and they get a ton of views and I become rich. Hope you guys did enjoy the video. Drop a like if you did. Subscribe if you're new. Comment, share with your friends. I'll see you boys later. And as always, don't forget to spam pesh.